guys, we are back again. <laughs> so here we are at our last location. I'm not sure if you can see it. <laughs> so around here? Yeah, that one. <laughs> yeah, so we are here at our last location. Uh, it's called Cholchusan. Uh, this one has like a very creepy history actually. Uh, it was way back when Catholicism, actually Christianity just came to Korea and one of the king, yeah, one of the, oh yeah, yeah, I think it's the, yeah, it was the king, yeah, the right. president. <laughs> so he killed a lot of people on this mountain, and it's actually called the uh, decapitated mountain, or something like that, because he actually cut their heads off. And actually, there's also a cemetery here. There's a museum of the martyrs, and the legend says that when they killed all those people, the hand river turned red. So it was that much blood. Yeah, so so yeah, we will go and see. Curious who that is. Let's see, because they have a lot of statues here. So I'm kind of curious. I'm not really sure if you can see him. So this is Crucio, shield of fate or sword of the Holy Spirit of Saint Paul. It's St. Paul with the sword. So this is St. Paul, guys. Okay. That one looks like Mary with the child. But I'm not 100% sure. Because if you don't know... Korea, yeah, Holy Mother. Riverside. Riverside Holy Mother. It's not actually... It's from River. She's not... Yeah. You see, she looks like a... More like a mermaid. Yeah, exactly. I wanted to see that a say that actually Koreans don't believe uh, in anything else besides Jesus and God. I think that this is the guy who Oh, he's someone. Or Pedro. They made this a whole park to honor the martyrs that died here and that actually they were killed and it is says to be very haunted <laughs> by those who were killed here yeah, it's like in, in 1968 yeah so this is the park, guys. And it looks like a cross. See? See, it's like a mm. Yeah, so... In 1866... Yeah. That was the museum, but the museum is closed. But there is another... There is another shrine. Oh, who is this? I think it's written there. Like on the book. Uh, Jesus carrying the palm of victory. This is Jesus Christ, guys. I think this place looks and feels super creepy at night. Because there are like 
first of all, there's a lot of history in this place. And second of all, they have a lot of things with crosses and Jesus. And uh, the shape of the parts, you see, it's a, it's a cross. Oh, this is San Teresa of Calcutta. They have a lot of... Um, how can I say? Not... Saints? Saints. A lot of saints. Mm -hmm. And people actually come and put flowers here. So this is the cross, guys. Oh my god. So guys, they actually... They have... Uh, place where they can light candles. This reminds me a lot of Romania. Mm -hmm. Because we have the same idea in Romania to light candles. Yeah. I think you can... Mm -hmm. I didn't even see it. So, can you buy them somewhere? I was really curious. Can you buy somewhere the candles and go there or they are just... Definitely this part looks super creepy. It just gives me a weird vibe. I don't know why. And if you go to Japan, you will... Because the vibe in Japan is like... Really, really... Super vibe. <laughs> oh. And especially they have like these things like all over the park. There are statues of people, of sand of a lot of things so we actually came here very early like it was the six or six yeah so i think this would be a really haunted location if you actually come at night like it, it really looks like it's haunted Maybe because of the statues or something, yeah. I don't know. And just remember, like, this is actually called the Hill of Decapitated, so... Headless people, whatever, what they call it. Because they cut their heads off, so... Even the story is super... I don't know, sad? Creepy? Oh, maybe. Okay guys, so this was our last video for the Halloween series. We hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you want to visit Hall and visit some very nice places, you can come to all these four locations. Yeah. 
and yeah, let like leave out your like opinions uh, through comments and don't forget to like our video and uh, subscribe. Yes. yes. So if you, like if you are yeah, interested in some Korean history, this is a place to visit. Yeah, this is this is a really nice place to visit, and it actually has a lot of history. And people come here to pray, so this is a qu very quiet place. And I think in the night will be way creepier because of the vibe that gives you. So yeah. Mm. Okay. See you next time. Bye.